Hi guys, wanted to pull together this very quick, very simple video just to guide you through some webinar registration page best practices so that you can get the maximum number of people signing up for your webinars at the minimum amount of cost to advertise it. So let's dive into the page and have a look, shall we? Okay, so let's start out. What is it that makes this webinar registration page more impactful and better than a potential webinar page that you might be using today? First up, let's have a look across the top here. What we have across the top here is a clear headline that speaks to visitors. So when the visitors land on this page, they know exactly what this page is about because they're seeing the headline here of how to build and deliver a persuasive pitch to get what you want. Now look at couple of things here. Firstly, the headline is obviously smack at the top, so it's clear to a visitor what this webinar is about. And it's clear because it's a live webinar with yours truly. But then the webinar headline here is talking how to build and deliver a persuasive pitch. So for someone that's not interested in improving their pitch, they're going to sort of bounce straight off here. But if they are interested, this is speaking directly to them because it's how to build and deliver a persuasive pitch. And then this is where I peek it pick their interest is to get what you want. In other words, I talk to their their self-interest and their, shall we say, selfishness. You need your headlines to do exactly the same. So speak to the audience member that you want joining you for your webinar and then pick, find a way to tap into their self-interest or their selfishness. Below this, you see that they are, we have the clear date and time. So this webinar was conducted on Monday the 9th of November and I had just a couple of time frames here for across across Australia so that people understand what time it is where wherever their location is. Make it nice and clear when the webinar is so there's no confusion. It's clear as clear as it needs to be so that someone, if they want to, can register for that webinar. If they know they're not going to be available, they obviously won't bother. I'll then drop down to here. During this free webinar, you will learn. And this is where they get the benefits of joining this webinar. You need to have potentially four or five, or as I've got here, five, but somehow listed up as six, six benefits. It's clear benefits that are talking to the individual. Similar to the headline, it's about making the benefits speak to the, to the person that is on the page and saying, okay, well, you've got to find ways to tap into their self-interest. What is it that they want to know? So in this case here, I'm talking about sharing with them the language psychology of a, sex, a successful pitch even and what the essential elements are. So it's all about tapping into what it is that they potentially don't know today that they need to know to have a successful pitch and finding out how they can connect with any audience. So it's all, you see the, the benefits here are structured in the sense that they're all you focused benefits. They're all you from the audience perspective. So what is it that someone is going to get by turning up for this webinar, what are they going? What are they? What are they going to enjoy or experience as a result? Then move across here, just a little picture and like basically a picture and my name there, just to show, put a little bit of personality behind it to show that there's a real person that's going to be delivering this webinar. Now, I always put myself on camera for my webinars so that again deepens connection. But this first up, just have a little picture there to show that hey, this is a real human being. There's some personality behind the webinar. So they know who it is that they're go who's going to be delivering the information to them. Now, most importantly, I've got two calls to action, but it's the same call to action, but in two spots. So no matter where they are on the page, they can they can register. We have it up the top here. So if people don't want to get as far down as the benefits, they can register now for the webinars. And it's explicit. Click below to sign up now. And then they got the register now button. And that then launches into a launches a a registration button so they click on the register now button it launches a registration button where it shows this is set up as an automated webinar but basically all I'm asking them is to put in their name and email keeping minimal amount of information for them to actually register for the webinar I'm not asking them for phone number a physical address any other unnecessary details keeping it really simple and the register now button is also down the bottom with again just a little bit of uh, urgency put into the factor as well by saying that we've got limited seats available on the webinar 
and again telling them to claim their spot now so when you click on that register now button it leads to exactly the same uh, same registration pop up as you saw before also one final little thing got the little share page here so share this page so that that way there's an opportunity for some free additional promotion at minimal effort minimal cost to me so these are the essential elements you want to have a good clear headline clear benefits articulate when the webinar is have a nice little picture and name for whoever's presenting the webinar but most importantly have a clear call to action tell them what to do so click to sign up now that's it that's the essential elements that you need to have on your webinar registration pages so have a review back on any registration pages that you have today and make sure that they've got these essential elements uh, covered on them.